my channel. I'm Jenna, and today I have a very special guest, Baisto. Hello, everyone. I'm going to leave his channel down below, and you can go ahead and check it out. But today, <laughs> we are doing a, like, we first were going for a wearable glam, um, and then that got to <laughs> So thing. now we're just doing, like, a get ready with me, um, something. Mm -hmm. I did, like, a warmer kind of tone look, smoked out. So I did a pop of color, yes, obviously. beautiful. So we're we'll just going to go ahead and get into the video. Okay, so we already did our brows, and now we're going to put our hair back. So I use two primers. I use for my Tuesday and I use the Step 1 Equalizer by Makeup Forever, the smoothing primer. And then I've been trying the Becca Black White Priming Filter for the rest of my face for glow and I love it. I use the Benefit Professional Matte Rescue for the um, outer perimeters of my face. And then I use just the regular Professional on my T-zone because I'm a little more oily. A little more oily. <laughs> <laughs> and then I, I've already moisturized and everything. You're, you're I am. Okay. Yep. And we already did our best so. So we both use the Real Techniques Beauty Sponges. Yours is so, how, how, what do you use to um to clean yours? So I used to use like the pump soap, but it takes so long to do that. Mm. So I just use like a bar soap and I scrub it and then I like wash it and squeeze it. It's so quick, it's right. so much better. What foundation are you using? I'm using the L'Oreal and Favre Pro Matte Foundation in the color 103. Love it. I can't decide, I'm probably gonna mix these two, the Too Faced Born This Way Foundation in the mm -hmm. shade Pearl and the Estee Lauder Double Wear in one and one. Ivory nude. And then like how do you do you put it on the back of your hand? You just put it straight on your beauty blender. Straight on the sponge. Oh my god. Shit, I'm so weird. Yeah, I'm so weird when it comes to foundation because I legitimately like have to pour it. Because people put it on their hands, but like I can't do that. I have to, oh, <laughs> <there it goes. laughs> I have to buy I had to put it on like uh, I use post-it notes, but Okay, so now we're doing concealer. What do you use? The Kat Von D Like It in the color L15 Neutral. Okay, I'm using the Tarte Shape Tape in light to highlight. And I'm using the um, Good Old Codeine Aerosol Powder. Transfuser. They started selling that at Walgreens. I thought you just got it at like Walmart and that was it. I didn't know that you could get it. I could, I could not buy that at Walgreens anyway. Really? Yeah. I saw it in like the back corner. I was about to buy it, but then I didn't. <laughs> I'm glad how it's so inexpensive, but it's like good. Yeah. I'm getting a little more of a surprise. Best believe I'm getting um, Botox when I get older. Really? When I get older, Where? as in two years. Where? I want it on my smile lines. Ooh, yeah. My forehead, I can't get any wrinkles. Hmm. Look. I'm getting a fucking wrinkle. Let's get it now. Like, legitally, I have, like, the, you know, the, the Wi Fi signs? Like, that's what I have. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad. Now I'm just gonna take a big fluffy brush and make it. Brush it. Yeah. Okay. Damn, you get a lot of powder in this. It, it smells kind of like. It smells like baby powder. Like an old powder. grandma kind of. I love this. It smells like baby powder. I'm loving it. I'm big my chin because I have. I usually just pick my under eyes. This is as much powder as I actually have. Do you yeah. pick your smile lines? I do. I just did. <gasps> yes. I did. It actually really does work because I always find that I get like. And I smile a lot. I mean, like I feel like having smile lines is good because like it looks like you have emotion. Yeah. Like brushes. <laughs> Girl, it's a crack house. <laughs> <laughs> Makeup crack house. <coughs> this brush is the Mega Brush, Mega Earth, what? Airbrush Mega Powder Brush from Ulta. Like, they're, I actually really like their brushes. It Cosmetics is Ulta. What? <laughs> I always, for the longest time, thought It Cosmetics was, like, legitimately the brand of Ulta. I didn't know that they were separate, like, Ulta brand and, like, Amazonian clay um, foundation by Tarte. I'm using the L'Oreal True Match um, foundation powder in the color W3 Neutral Beige. Do you like that? Nude beige. Do you like it? Uh, I love it. Um, to set my under eyes, I'm using Anastasia Banana. And I'm using the Kat Von D uh, Lyric, that's what it's called. It's the yellow powder. Well, not to set my under eyes, but like to make it look more brighter. Oh, yeah, brightening. Brightening. Right. I actually usually don't do like the yellow powder of the eyes because I am I have like pink tones. I'm rather than mm. yellow. So like I'm okay. always scared of like, but I kind of like it. Yeah, I'm more pink too, but I want to look yellow. Yeah. I, I strive to look. <laughs> I'm using the Hula Bronzer Damn by bitch. Benefit. Okay. Love it. Okay, I'm using. Oh my God, it's coming out. Havana. Havana. And oh gosh, that's <laughs> oh um, while he's getting that out, I'm using the Morphe E33 brush. This is the biggest freaking pan brush ever. Like even in the winter, I like to bronze. Like I didn't go a day without bronze. Yeah, no, 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 exactly. I can't not bronze. 
And then for contouring, I'm using the Sephora brush. This is like the only brush I have from Sephora. It's their Pro Air Blush, Airbrush Blush oh Brush. Gosh. It's a blush brush, but I use it for contouring. Done with that. And I'm using um, Subconscious and Shadow Play from the Kat Von D Contour. And to contour, I used Havana and Fawn. Yeah, we have two helpers back here. Just thought we'd um, mention so, them. Thank you, Emily and Amy, um, who's doing worm. nothing. <laughs> so and worm. Sitting on the ground. The helper is Emily. Yeah, just <laughs> Emily. Basically. Yeah. And there's nothing. Okay, now I'm going to take the same powder and sharpen my contour and bake my under. I'm gonna go ahead and with like a plain white shade all over uh, my lid to my brow bone. I haven't. Yeah. I haven't actually primed my eyelids yet. I probably should have, but I didn't do it yet. So um, I'm just gonna use the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm gonna use the shade Bare, and I'm gonna use linen and mix them together for from the Lorac Pro Matte Palette. So use that. For my transition, I'm gonna use shade Three from the L'Oreal Nudes Palette. I'm using a lot of L'Oreal stuff. This is like I don't know, twelve, number twelve. I'm using the Morphe E23 brush. Morphe is the bomb diggity. Use um, discount code based on. Oh, I'm just kidding. I, <laughs> I wish. I wish. wish. Oh my god. Like, I've always wanted to say that. Use discount code. Um, I'm sorry. Da -da 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 -da. I'm going to be using shade Cherry Cola from Makeup Geek. Okay, so we had some technical difficulties and we just switched over. So we don't really know where we ended, but I rebaked under my eyes and then we're still back at transition shades. Yeah, I'm um, deepening the crease with the same Cherry Cola. And then I'm just keep going with Frappe and Peach Smoothie, just building it up because I'm doing a warm eye today. Like, I'm a warm tone girl. I don't like cool tone stuff, so I'm like, do you prefer a warm or cool tone? Oh um, definitely warm. Yeah, I feel like it just complements everything. What's your favorite makeup brand? Mm, brands are brand hmm? Brands are like brand, like singular, like brand. Okay, can I just say a bunch? <laughs> <laughs> I'm done with my makeup. I like MAC, Morphe, Mink Geek, Too Faced. And I'm gonna say Tarte, like that's the the general, or yeah, that's probably good. Just real quick, I'm using the MAC 221, and I'm using uh, Coco Bear, my favorite shadow of all time for makeup. Ooh, I love Coco Bear. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. Missing it? It's so pretty. Like it's wow, it's gorgeous. I love it. It's a perfect warm brown. They have like a dupe for it in the 350M if you like, if anybody has that. Oh, shit, and I'm gonna do. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> there goes that. Well. Eden, hello, what are you doing? I'm also using cherry cola just to kind of deepen. Um, I'm doing literally everything that I did to this eye to this eye. Looks like they blend very well. Yeah, that's the one thing about, like, I really appreciate what they have. So, Makeup Geek, um, sponsor me. <laughs> <laughs> you just got to go If you're seeing this, Marlena, if you're seeing this, hit me up. I know her name. That's how depressing that is. Thank you. Thanks for, making, for sponsoring this video. <laughs> Literally. Weird. I wish. That would be like a dream. Back to reality. <laughs> Back, to, <laughs> you Back can... to actual reality now. More, the Too Faced Natural Eyes palette and it looks really gross. Like literally look how opposite. Like I've dropped it so many times like it doesn't even I've, clip shit anymore. I feel like all of them look like that. Really? Yeah. yeah I've never then, seen one that looks good. I'm gonna mix these three colors. Six. I love their names. Sexpresso, Erotica, and Chocolate Martini. Mm. I'm gonna use the Morphe M139. I'm gonna mix those and then. Okay. And now I'm gonna lay color. Uh, today I'm gonna use the shade Flamethrower from Makeup Geek. Sponsor my video, please. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I, I like it, but it's really, really hard to like do on okay, daily. This. I'm blending. I'm building. I'm using the just like the Urban Decay Naked brush from like one of their palettes. And I spray my brush with Mac Fix Plus because I love this stuff. My mother. <laughs> I use her function. I was like, I'm so sorry. Oh, uh, sorry. Um, yeah. well, this is uh, Marlena texting me about her sponsorship. Sponsorship. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Okay. I forgot we're doing one eye, so I'm like getting tripped up. Yeah. I'm four days later. Oh, oh my God! You're still on. I didn't even. I've done both of my eyes already. Like, pretty much. Yeah, and we'll be right back while yeah, she does like her other eye. Literally. <laughs> like. Okay, so I'm finally done. Took freaking forever. So, bake, wiping that bake away. Like um, and bake. I'm going to do a pop of color. I'm literally everything. dropping everything right now. Yeah, Where are my brushes? Why was that necessary to scream? Because I don't know where they went. I'm using use the same colors that I used in my crease, and I'm just kind of building it up. Mostly Cocoa Bear because that's like all the only color I ever use. 
lashes. I know okay. people who do like eyeshadow and then don't like don't wear um, lower lash line eyeshadow. Like I know people who do that. It's, it's like a sin, literally. I know people that wear mascara on the mm -hmm. other top lash. Oh yeah, my, that I drives me crazy. I know so many people do that. It drives me crazy. Like lower lashes are make everything better. So I don't it know just why. looks dumb. It's Do you remember like your first makeup product you ever used? Like what you how you started out with it? Um probably when I was like, I don't know, like three or five or something yeah, like, like yeah. really small. Mm -hmm. I can't remember. I was always in like theater and stuff, so I'd always like have to do like show makeup and things. So that's kind of how I started like building mm -hmm. my makeup kit. And yeah. it was like how I was exposed to it. And I like sort of watching YouTube is always like the thing that like really brought me to start using yeah. more makeup, honestly. Like it was like I always watch people and I was like, I wish I had that much makeup. Like makeup collection videos, I feel like those are just like, oh my God. like you're so like, much. I wish I had that. So I think that was kind of what it drove me to do makeup. I have my weird like cup of eyeliners. Does that, does that look fine? Does that look yes, fine? Pretty. I, wait, what eyeliner do you use? This is L'Oreal, nothing Ooh, new. Yes. Um, the Super Slim Liquid Eyeliner. Oh. Yeah, I'm using Kavon D tattoo liner. Oh, and I use, like, do you like it? I do, but it doesn't go well over glitters. Like, because it's like, I don't know. I, I feel like, know. no, I haven't found like my true true oh. eyeliner that does. I like the Wet n Wild one. I was in a show this I was in Pendant like I said, I use that stuff for. Um, legitimately, like, this girl, her name's Jordan. If you're, if you're watching this, hey, love you. Um, like, Wet n Wild eyeliner she used. It's like black, and it was so good. I need to mm -hmm. find it. Like, I tried to find it in Walgreens. I couldn't find it. It's gorgeous. Yeah. Because. Jenna doesn't like wings. My mom calls them bat wings, so she's like, Jenna, take the bat wings off. Mom, love Brooke. Hey, Brooke, if you're watching. I honestly, like, I, okay, that's not horrible. Oh my god, wings are so hard. I mean, exactly, like, they're really hard. And I like, I literally have some. So I have good eyeliners and bad eyeliners. Oh, never mind. This is bad. Remember, what, are, what do they say? They're sisters, not twins. Sisters, not twins. But I like them to be twins. I know. Well, honestly, eyelashes will cover them up because I'm going for big eyelashes today. What are you wearing? Uh, probably, probably one of my cocoa lashes. Probably yeah, cocoa man, lashes and goddess. I don't like these lashes. But you like them? I have a feeling I'm not going to. I don't know. They just seem like I'm always the wispier. Like, the wispier is my type of thing. But this is, like, stiffer. So we'll see how this goes. Chinese things. It's 2017. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, can you get me a napkin? <laughs> that looks not right. That's YouTube all video That's gone. That's a little chocolate on it. <laughs> YouTube video gone wrong. What happened? I just got the whole down on his crotch. White eyelash glue. Bay knows what that's like. <laughs> <laughs> White so far. <laughs> Are you looking for prom? Yes. I have a couple already, I'm really excited about it. It just kind of sucks, like prom, literally, it's on one day, so like you can't do too many, you know it's what I mean? so hard, like. It's hard to like book them on, because you never know, like things could set you back, and like. Okay, so done with uh, lashes, and I'm gonna deepen my crease with this shade from ColourPop called Paradox. <laughs> and I'm just gonna go with a dark brown shade to deepen my crease, just like Jenna's doing. This is like a redier tone, so I'm just kind of warming it up. I like red. You gotta be careful, because you look like you can get punched in the eye. <laughs> oh, very. And, and that now that we're both gonna contour our nose. Contour my nose, and I'm gonna recontour my cheeks just because. Um, With I Havana. Okay, blush. We're doing MAC Peaches, and I'm gonna mix that with Exposed from Tarte. I'm seeing um, the new Tajita blush, surprisingly, there's a drugstore, yeah, um, and 20 vibrants with a big fluffy brush, this is the 133. I'm going to use just like an eco, I like this brush because it's like nice and tapered, but it's fluffy, so I'm using that from eco. Yes. And to highlight, I'm using my 140 and my Champagne Pop, but I'm also going to go in with, I think, Lit, no, I'm going to I'm going to go with Strobe and Stunner from the Tarte Pro. I'm gonna use MAC Soft and Gentle and I'm gonna mix it with King Tut Skin Frost from Jeffree Star. They're really similar actually, but just King Tut's darker. Oh, Lord. Be careful with it. Because I'm not like a super big highlight girl, but. Very soft, right? Yeah. <laughs> Very soft. Soft and gentle. <laughs> for the day. Doing an recorder? We are. In a corner. 
I'm, I'm using the completely broken um, pearl from Becca. I'm gonna highlight my brow bone real quick. Oh, real quick. Too Faced with like any white. Color. I'm just using something from that Too Faced Naturals. It's called Day. I'm putting Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. Hair spray for your brows. Love you have a hair in your eyelash. Oh, great. <laughs> brow gel is my... Okay. I'm using Cafonte Lolita for my just general look, and I'm probably going to go in with Naked by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm using Androgyny. Mm -hmm. No, I'm probably... Wait. Celebrity Skin. Celebrity Skin, okay. Yeah. From Jeffree Star. She's nude. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we had a couple camera problems, but we finished our looks. We put a little gloss on and our lips on. So we're done, and we hope you enjoyed this video. I will leave a face channel down below so you can go check him out. And if you are from Face Channel, please subscribe. To um Jenna. <laughs> subscribe to Jenna. Check her out, she's amazing. Um yeah. So if, I hope you enjoyed. Follow us on Insta. Yes. More to come. Everything will be in the description. Yes. Like, rate, subscribe. Bye.